Hi everybody. Today we're going to make salt dough starfish and salt dough coins. Start out by gathering your materials. Create a batch of salt dough by following the kit's instructions. This will make a full batch of the salt dough. Section your dough into different size balls to form the bases of your starfish. You'll want to make sure they are at least the size of a golf ball or larger. Now we begin to shape the starfish. Flatten out one of the balls and start to pinch out five evenly paced sections from the ball of dough. These will become the arms of your starfish. You can always add or remove dough to even out the size of the arms. Gently pull on the blobs to turn them into starfish arms. Play around and adjust the arms until you get the shape you'd like. Once you have the basic shape, customize your starfish. You can add texture, put little dots of dough on the arms. Check out the included templates in order to get some ideas. You can let the dough dry for several days or follow the baking instructions in the salt dough kit. Now we're ready to make some treasure coins. Pinch off small pieces of dough and then roll them into a ball. The ball should be relatively small, between the size of a cherry pit and a cherry, depending on the size of coins you want to sculpt. Press the balls flat into discs on a well-floured work surface and sculpt the edges as needed. Not all pirate coins were perfect circles, so it's okay if some discs are wonky. Let the disc dry for several days or bake in the oven following the instructions in the salt dough kit. You can use any leftover dough to make more starfish or more coins. Remember to keep unused dough in an airtight container and in a cool place.
Let the starfish and disc dry for several days or bake in the oven following the instructions in the salt dough kit. Once completely dry, you can draw or paint on the details of your coin and starfish.